The other uh, worry I was mentioning a little earlier for the markets right now, this idea that stimulus talks might be falling apart. That might be a bit of a stretch. Let's get the read, though, from uh, Tennessee Republican Congressman Chuck uh, Fleischman. Uh, Congressman, always good to have you. Thank you for taking the time. Uh, a are they falling apart? I don't think so. Uh, obviously, these are very complex negotiations going on between the House, the Senate, and the White House. There are large areas of agreement, and there are large areas of disagreement. But it's a process. Uh, everyone is cognizant of the fact that the clock is ticking. We are closing in on the end of the 116th Congress. We have certain deadlines that are going to come into play, like the December 31st expiration of uh, unemployment benefits. So work is in progress. Uh, it is difficult. But let's be optimistic and hope we can get it done. Where are the differences? We're told that, um, you know, the liability protection that Senator Mitch McConnell wanted on the other side of the Senate, I know you're in the House, um, he's, 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 he's not made that a demand. Um, the president has apparently weighed in, or at least the White House has, supporting the big package as it stands now, the roughly $900, $910 billion package. So what is holding it up? I think several factors. I do think liability protection is important for American businesses and for all concerned in a very difficult time. But I don't know exactly where all the lines in the sand are. As time ticks, perhaps some of those will dissipate. But as we look at the different factors, first of all, size of the package. Different folks have different ideas from the Gang of Eight in the Senate, uh, which has that $908 billion uh, package out there. The House and the Senate perhaps wanted larger ones. The White House came in with a very interesting request recently for the $600 of individual stimulus. That had previously really not been in the game. So I think people are all doing their bidding uh, from their respective corners. But we're all watching the clock. We all realize that the American people want something done. And I've said all along, as long as we focus on common sense, common ground solutions to this problem, we can probably get there. All right. Uh, from your mouth to uh, the country's ears. <laughs> Congressman, thank you very, very yes, much sir. for that update. We appreciate it.